Hello there my fellow modelers. So let's do today again uh, a nice review of, of what's in the box. This time we open a box of a border model kit scale 135. In this case it's the Panzer IV Ausführen H. The box includes four figures. 12 sprues in total, some photo edge decals and some 14 different painting and marking guides very interesting all highly detailed plus some goodies like always with the border models they always like to include some interesting goodies in this case you get some nice Zimrit tool and a metal barrel included and of course as I told you before there are four uh, figures uh, included in, in the kit so let's see what, what's in the kit. Let's start with the building manual. As you can see nice box art. Some historical background and explanation about the vehicle. Here you can see the sprues. It's around 12 sprues as I told you. So let's look. The assembly is all nice explained always, so no, no much uh, jibber jabber straightforward. You got the assembly of the turret for example, the gun. The figures. Yeah, they have long legs, I noticed too, but they made them by purpose long so you can put them, place them nice in your vehicle, so that's the reason. <laughs> so here you got the different uh, painting and marking guides, also very interesting. But as I told you guys, there are 14 different of them. So a lot to choose of. <laughs> Very interesting ones. You know from all uh, areas and battlefields, different ones. For... So let's take a peek at that uh, photo edge now. You got here the side skirts, two of them. I mean, two, uh, two pair each side. <laughs> The decals, a lot of them, all nice and uh, matte colored, so not much shininess that comes through later. So, as you can see, there's, there's a lot of choice here. The metal barrel. And the Zimmerit tool, wait a bit, here you go, also included. Now take a look at the sprues. As always very nice and detailed as you guys can see. And there is a nice sagging already. Wait a bit, I'll show you guys. Here you go. On the tracks.
the drive sprockets, the, uh, the road wheels as you can see here. All nice and crisp detail. Some more tracks. <laughs> as I told you, uh, there, there is a lot of plastic in this box, contains this box. So here you go. Another one. You have also the choice you can use your metal barrel or here you got one piece mold plastic barrel but also like to keep it in plastic all nice and crisp details Some more parts with the uh, drive wheels and sprocket. Some part of suspension. Plus you get always also a nice bucket here to include. It's always nice to have them. If you want to decide to make some diorama, it's also always nice to have some few tiny extras on it. Parts of the upper hull and the back side, front side, machine gun. And some more sprues, keep on coming. Those are also like accessories, some jerry cans. T34 tracks for extra armor to put on. So there's a lot you can do with it. There's many options. Again, you have here a bucket to include in a diorama. All nicely detailed, see. The lower hole, as you can see, it's a bathtub hole. Pre built. Again, superb in the details. Here we got the turret. And crisp and fine in his details. The storage bin. Look at those rivets, all nice done. Nice thing to paint. Now I'm gonna show you guys the figures. They're a bit small looking, but uh, the details are nice and fine. You can see all nicely detailed all over.
So that's it for today guys, if you please hit the like button and uh, leave a comment of course and any suggestions and please subscribe for support, ok? See you again, see you next time and stay safe all there, bye!